We've heard a lot about the extra burden the pandemic has placed on what we call last responders. Riverside County Sheriff's Coroner's Office has been dealing with the pandemic for a year now, just like the rest of us. But what has this year been like for them? Our Kitty Alvarado got an exclusive look at the work of last responders. Since the pandemic started over a year ago, working at the Riverside County Sheriff's Coroner's Office has been different. Lieutenant Anthony Townsend, who runs the NDO Bureau, says while they planned for it, they never imagined they'd be putting a pandemic plan in place. This is unquestionably a hundred year event. I haven't seen anything like this in my 21 years. Early on, they didn't know what they were dealing with. We didn't. In the initial phases of this, we didn't know a lot about the virus, how easily it was to contract from decedents. So we treat everybody still the same, just as though it is communicable. The Riverside County Coroner's Office is already one of the busiest in the state, but during the surge, their call volume has tripled. A tremendous call volume increase, um, probably anywhere in the nature of two to three times the reported deaths every day. So pre-COVID, we may receive a, anywhere from 30 to 60 death reports a day. Um, during the, the largest last holiday surge, uh, we received probably anywhere from 80 to 110. Something that rarely ever happens has become standard during COVID. Maxed out hospital and funeral home morgues calling on their expertise and storage capacity. If their storage capacity for decedents is limited, uh, the coroner's office can step in and assist them. How many times have you gotten that call within the last year? Too numerous to count. They've even taken unprecedented measures to help ease capacity. We, uh, along with the health department, did request um, that the um, South Coast Air Quality Management District suspend crematory limits. This time hasn't been easy. They're dealing with the same fears and stresses that have hit all families. Plus, the additional dangers of dealing with a virus that lurks at every turn. And so you go into that house, we put on the full bunny suit with a respirator so we understand that we don't want to bring this back to the office and infect our co-workers much less do we want to take it home so it has given a new meaning to what death investigation is. Like the sheriff's motto, service above self. The employees here have really taken that to heart over the last year. In Indio, Kitty Alvarado, NBC Palm Springs.